Hey, what up, Z Clan and everybody else? How you doing? I hope you're doing good. Welcome to my Fallout 76 notification video. In this video, we'll cover some quick news. Uh, then take a look at the Atomic Shop because today is Tuesday, so we should be having something free or some discounts. I don't know. Uh, we'll take a look as I've kept my first impression to see uh, or. <laughs> whichever and then we're gonna take a look at the daily and the weekly challenges see what we gotta do in order to make some score and uh, the daily ops see what we are gonna be facing plus I'm gonna display my today's reward which I hope is not gonna be no more science please God uh, anyway let's not wasting time and jump right into it All right, so the first quick update is the more storage, more storage. Well, we should have more storage, and we do. <laughs> now we can store up to one thousand twelve hundred uh, pounds, or you know, the limit. <laughs> Thank you, because uh, I'm actually fully loaded, and I need to get rid of some stuff and put it in there. I think I'll fill that up like real fast. Anyway, what else we got on the menu? Alright, so we got three new tabs in our pip boy in the item section. So you can see a section new is probably something that you pick up like like if you pick it up it's gonna be marked as new. Like uh let's make for example we drop this thing right here, right? And what's gonna happen? Uh we'll pick it up. Pip boy say That's a new oh and it's got a timer as well. Sweet, so it tells you uh when you picked it up. Okay, cool, cool, cool. I like that. Uh, also, we have the uh, apparel section. So now it's easier to maneuver through our outfits, which is actually really nice because I always had issues. Oh, they actually even removed it from the armor section. Sweet. Good job. Good job. I like that. I like this update. Uh, food and drink. So over here, you'll have your food and drinks. Spoiled meat. Actually, that's also pretty cool. I mean, in eight section, we should have like I don't know, like cams, bubble heads, and stuff like that. But the food and drinks should be gone, right? That's actually really nice as well, because we do have some challenges sometimes, time to time, where we gotta eat candy or food, and bam. By the way, you're asking how the hell is this guy who's got almost three thousand candies? Well, if you do the event called. Uh, uh, I forgot what is it called. Monster Mash. That's how it's called. In Batoga High School City. Uh, high School City, lol. Batoga High School. <laughs> uh, you'll get a lot of Halloween candies. I keep those uh, because it, they help me to complete challenges real fast. And by the way, also, they made an update. I've been reading that, that now it also tells you the weight of the total amount of. So you can see uh, my Halloween candies weigh slightly over 0 0.001. But that's because I have perks on. Uh, so for the red ale, okay, cool. So yeah, so the weight stack it actually shows the stack. So in total, uh, the all 76 water purifiers they uh, take off four of my weight. So if I drop them, for instance, I should be seeing 371 and 371. <laughs> Pretty cool. Okay, that, that is actually really handy in terms of uh, managing your stuff. Uh, yep. Yeah, so new tabs food drink apparel and new and this notification as I said in a little bit of details and two more quick updates is now we can see the three stars one star and stuff like that at vending machines I think that means no stars at all uh, he's got two stars three stars okay there we go now it's actually really nice to see whether if you want to travel there and you know because traveling also takes up time. Then the final update, uh, the color of the building menu has changed as well from green to blue. So there we go. And that is good. I prefer the blue one. <laughs> well, let's get to the atomic shop. Alright, so I switched to my wife's account and uh, because it doesn't own anything so we can see all the prices. Let's see what we got. Atomic shop. Ooh, shelters? Wow. Later on, I'm going to switch back to my other account, to my main account, because it's got Fallout first. Uh, the patch notes, by the way, are as always late. With a delay. Yep, they're still not up. 
So volt water shelters? Are you serious? Man, I haven't even built in the other two sections. Cause I don't know what to build. I'm waiting for those displays for the for, for the ability for us to actually uh build our displays within the shelters. I'm not I'm not gonna be spending hours and hours and hours trying to decorate stuff when, you know, the most important things aren't there. So okay. Park Ranger Power Armor Skin. That actually looks dope. You can see it's got this. I'm pretty sure it's animated, like the light on the shoulder. It's oh, on both shoulders. That's actually pretty nice. Too bad I'm not a power armor user. But please, those who are gonna buy this, I know some of you will. Z Clan, please share some screenshots in our Atomic Shop chat on Discord. All right, I'm pretty sure a lot of people will say thank you. All right, so what else we got? Sofas. Okay, for a bar or something like that, that should work out pretty good. Oh, there we go. There we go. <laughs> Fancy bar set. It's a very old uh, cam item, but it's a really cool one. Uh, it's a shame that the discount is only 20%. I remember it's being bigger up to 70 if not. If, yeah, 70%, I believe. 50 sometimes we got. But this is a cool uh, fancy bar set. You get the wall decors, those two bar stands, uh, the tables, and three variants of the chairs. So it's actually really nice. Uh, Slocum's dinner bar set. I didn't get this one and I don't plan to. Uh, Slocum's billboard. Then we got Nuka Cola Quantum sign. I recommend getting it. I love all these signs. So all of this plus 50% discount. Is definitely something you might want you want to have if you're building a uh, <laughs> bar. <laughs> All right, so from the junkyard, eh? it's like I'm having a deja vu or something. Was this last week? No, no, it wasn't here. So it's also yeah, 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 it wasn't last Tuesday. Let's pop back again. I don't know. I'll, I'll think of uh, if I'll be buying the bundle, and if I will, I'll be making a review for it. Ammo converter. Well, I I mentioned my common black last week, but I wouldn't waste my atoms on it or wait for a discount. Uh, yeah. White Springs Resort. There we go. Some free posts over here. Leaving soon. Uh, shelters mainframe bundle. I don't know. Voltec uh, prototype purifier. The uh, bone gas mask is actually a pretty cool mask. I'm I'm actually wearing it. You sh you see me wear it at the very start of the video, and if you check out my old l the last video I've uploaded on the uh, Alpha combos, you'll see it there in more details. Okay, desk fan stuff like that, and no discounts whatsoever. The heart wrench. All right. So apparently, this has to do with an event, by the way, which I forgot to mention from the news. So definitely gonna have to grab that one. I'm gonna do that with my main, and it's a skin. All right. So let's take let's head back to my main and uh, take a look at the full off first if there is anything like that, and take a look at the heart wrench and the event. Alright, so th there is nothing for the follow up first over here in our section. And then if we scroll all the way to the special, we have the Plague Doctor Mask, which is the follow up first, I believe. So it's uh, with a discount. Now, I did forget to mention that there is a new event and it has to do with challenges. So you'll need to acquire this. And this is a weapon skin. Uh, bam, bam, bam. Show your enemies how much you truly love them with the Heart Wrench. Be sure to check your challenges for limited time. Spread the love. <laughs> so yeah, it's called uh, Spread the Love and it lasts until February the 16th. So once you pick it up, right, in the challenges section over here, you will see that we have a daily Spread the Love, Kill Enemies with the Hard Wrench 5 and get a repair kit. <laughs> okay, whatever. 
Uh, but then also in the weekly we've got spread the love, kill robots with the hard wrench, right? You kill 30 of them, and you get rub coat, t-shirt, and shorts. <laughs> so okay, uh, yeah. Let's take a look. Uh, wrench, wrench, wrench. All right. So I I think this is the one we need. And too bad I don't have a a legendary version. Because if I ever had. <laughs> A legendary version of this thing most probably I got rid of it okay uh, it sucks it sucks it sucks because I'm not a melee build oh well so then we should go to modifications and there we go boom and now we'll need to use this thing to uh, defeat robots or whatever and we should be doing it well actually let's do that challenge together and on top of everything else, by the way, there is uh, an edit to the dodgy perk. Uh, there is a delay, so it doesn't like uh, it doesn't drain your uh, AP super fast. Let's ch check this out together right now. And uh, it, the card still works during the refresh. So uh, let's see how it works. Because previously, when we used it, I used the dodge. If I were to be shot with a machine gun, then uh, yeah, you see? One, two, boom. It's, well, it should be working. But anyway, I hope. <laughs> this is gonna take some time to do. So I'm using that wrench right now. Yay! Oh, I forgot to mark it. Hold on. Challenges. Weekly. There you go. Oh my god. 30. <laughs> this is gonna take some time. You know what I'm gonna do since I'm not a melee build first I will shoot him and make sure that I don't kill him right and Then I'll switch and just bam 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 cuz man What is going on? The <laughs> what is that? That is so dumb. Oh my god Lol. Yeah, it's gonna take some time. But you gotta kill 30 robots and you'll get that outfit. So it's limited amount of time. Uh, for this one, we got an entire week. Oh, by the way, uh, didn't we have a daily challenge that we get a repair kit if we kill five? <laughs> ah, there you go. <laughs> it worked. So I just got myself a repair kit. Boo hoo. <laughs> but. We can also get sometimes over there uh, lunch boxes and some other stuff. Uh, yeah, so basically earn lunch boxes, uh, perk cards, packs, and repair kits by defeating enemies with your heart wrench every day during the spread the love event. So basically, these are going to be challenges, and I believe those things are going to be rotate, or like rotating. So if you, today we get the repair kit, tomorrow we might going to get the lunchbox, or you know later on we might going to get some perk cart or whatever. All right, let's see uh, what else we got to do for the daily and the weekly before I get killed. All right, so for the dailies, we got complete daily operation. Okay, as usual, complete an event, pretty straightforward. This one triggers automatically as soon as you do five dailies. Kill a legendary enemy, level up, nuclear winter, use stim pack three times, repair armor, weapon, or power armor three times, visit another player's shelter. Okay, pretty straightforward. Uh, weekly build up your workshop or camp. So you got to build floor decors, wall decors, and stuff like that. You see the full list over here. Uh, claim a workshop five times. Uh, collect caps daily. Uh, complete daily operation five times. Do a daily. I mean a daily challenge gold star over here, and uh, this will trigger automatically. So I'm gonna get that done today. Complete ten events. Kill a legendary ten times. Level up three times. Repeatable. Repair armor, weapons, stuff like that, ten times, and you will get score score man I'm rank 77 I still need to go all right and essentially we got spread the love spread the love spread the love <laughs> all right for the daily ops we've got too bad it's not robots man I would go and swing that flower stuff too bad it's no robots but we got 
the Boros, Super Mutants, and Cloak when not attacking. Let's see what I'm going to get today. Oh, and by the way, uh, another update I forgot to mention. See, I should have done a separate video on that, but okay, since I already mentioned most of it. Well, I'm going to have the link to that patch notes over there in this video, so you'll be able to take a look at it, or just wait for a uh, more professional YouTuber in terms of news to deliver it for you. Yeah, because there are a lot. Oh, so the blue color not only changed for the building menu, but for actually placing the power armor. Yeah, I'm just going to get in my power armor here. Because uh, I have my wrong build right now, and uh, better do it like this. So basically, in regards to the change in daily ops, well, apparently there's supposed to be a guarantee that you will get... Um, oh, Kropowski, I made a mistake. I can't run. Apparently, you're guaranteed to get a daily reward in case if you um, get the... Elder rank, so the top rank, and apparently it turns out now I know why uh, sometimes we'll get none, okay? Because none would have was happening when you get a duplicate of a plan that you already learned from stuff that you can't trade. So for, for like for example, if you got a plasma pistol plan, which I still did not get, uh, if you got it and you got it today, you would get none. <laughs> That's how it worked. I didn't know that, to be honest. I thought it was just another option. Because I had, like, days when I would have, like, uh, three days in a row. None. 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 And that was, man, why am I even still trying to get this stupid damn pistol plank? Well, I, I actually really want it, so I don't care. Anyway, let's see what I'm going to get today. If I'm going to get none, man, I'm going to be pissed. <laughs> a quick test on Dodgy, by the way. I have the perk card on, so boom. I'm gonna take a lot of shots right now, and you, as you can see, my AP is not draining. This card is becoming OP OP, man. <laughs> I'm gonna love it. I mean, watch this. Clap it with Ricochet, and I'm wearing right now my, like, the worst armor, like, not my defensive armor, basically, and I'm still tanky as hell. <laughs> I love it. And here comes the boss. Man, with that perk now, it's so much easier. Ah, my MP is done. Come on, die. Show me what I get. You're lucky if I was in my power armor. If I was in my power armor, you'd die in seconds. But my, I got the wrong build on. <laughs> Forgot to switch my perks around. But anyway. So let's see what we got. 7 tw minutes, 20 seconds. Solo. Not bad. Elder. Crit, good. Neon signs. Ooh, I got two. <laughs> Are you serious? <laughs> I ask, please, no signs. Please, no signs. And I get two signs. <laughs> Psycho. <laughs> Alright Z-Clan and everybody else, I hope you enjoyed the show and if you did, you know the drill. Don't forget to hit that like, comment down below. Please make sure not to use profanity as those comments get triggered by YouTube. Nobody see them, nobody can read them, nobody can respond to them. So if you want your comments to be read, feel free to comment your negative, positive feedback, whichever. The only thing that I ask of you is not to swear. If you're new and subscribe, welcome to Z-Clan. I'm Gamer Z Soul from Ukraine, so hi from Ukraine. And if you want to join our clan, feel free to do so. The link to our Discord is down in the video description where we have chats for pretty much everything, including other games. We're over 800 members over there, pretty uh, active. Make sure to read the rules, because if you break our rules, you get bad. Simple as that. And uh, once again, thanks all for watching. You all have a good one day and night. Whatever you guys like it. Uh, I'll see you later. Bye. From the ashes we rose